The Ryobi 18 V1 Plus Cordless Band Saw has been one of the most requested in their lineup tools for years. The 590 is finally here, and we've been cutting a whole lot of metal and PVC with it. What can the Ryobi 18 V1 Plus Cordless Band Saw cut? The Ryobi 590 comes with a pair of 18 TPI blades which are great for general purpose metal and plastic cutting. It will cut wood, but you'll cut it faster with a lower TPI blade. The same goes for PVC and other plastics. It's also possible to cut stainless steel, rebar, and other hard and or thick metals. Go with a higher TPI blade for those. How fast will it cut? The brush motor moves the blade at 560 FPM, giving the Ryobi cordless band saw roughly twice the tooth engagement of a good reciprocating saw. When you are cutting things like 2-inch EMT or PVC for electrical and plumbing, you really notice how much faster it cuts compared to a one-hand reciprocating saw. The 560 FBM specification is on the higher side of the band saw spectrum. Even against traditional probe, powerhouses such as DeWall, Makita, and Milwaukee, the motor still has to keep that FBM up under load. Though, and that's where we see some of the pro models at cut Ryobi in tougher and thicker materials. How hard is it to change the blade? It's pretty simple to change the blade on the Ryobi 18 V1 Plus cordless band saw on a mostly tool-free job. Like most recent cordless saws, start by turning the tension release lever 180, then just work the blade through the rollers and around the pulleys. When you're taking the blade out, you might need a slotted screwdriver to help work it off around the backside. Design The overall design is in line with what we see from pro-level band saws. It has a pommel over the motor that helps you make a stable, accurate cut. With its position on the guard instead of in line with the trigger, it pretty well guarantees you have to cut right-handed. Ryobi includes a hang hook. How much does it cost? You can pick up the Ryobi 18 V1 Plus cordless bandsaw for $129 as a bare tool with a pair of 18 TPI blades. You can also get it with a 4.0 all battery and charger for $199. At the time I'm writing this review, the kit is on sale for $179. It goes without saying that this is a much better price than premium pro models. When you look around the DIY and prosumer landscape, skill, art, and craftsmen don't have a cordless porter band to compare. Overview If you're debating between something like this Ryobi cordless porter band or reciprocating saw, the band saw is definitely faster, has much less vibration, and gives you better accuracy. Buy it if you're looking for a relatively inexpensive cordless band saw that does a good job of cutting material up to 2, 1, or 2 inch. Pass if you're looking for the design quality of premium models. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.